tuning in to Eskimo TV, your home for icy and chilly movie reviews. I'm your host, Jason Escamilla, and today I'm reviewing The House with a Clock in Its Walls, which is directed by Eli Roth and stars Jack Black and Kate Blanchett, who play neighbors that often hang out at Jack Black's character's home. One day, Jack Black's nephew, who's played by Owen Vaccaro, comes over and we have a family-friendly fantasy film. This movie is really aimed towards younger audiences. Children are really gonna like this movie. It's very engaging for them. There's a very over-the-top fantasy element to it. You have a lot of physical harm humor, a lot of short quips that the characters make towards one another, and there's a lesson that the younger boy goes through in this movie that they actually might really enjoy. Adults will be slightly amused. There were some moments where I was smiling or I laughed a few times, but overall this is a very average film. The characters feel very contrived. In other words, they're not very believable. The nephew, whose name is Lewis in this movie, has a backstory that had potential to really pull at your heartstrings, and it sort of does, but I really think that it was a missed opportunity for the movie to really go more in depth with that story, for us to know more about it, so that way we could really like and feel more for this character. The antagonist is not very strong. The motivation and end goal that this character has is just not very realistic. And it was just funny. If you have kids, you can take them to go watch it. I think that they're going to like it. I think if you're an older adult, this is definitely going to feel like, why am I in here if you go watch it by yourself? It, you won't regret it. It's not a boring or hard to sit through movie. It's just very kid oriented is what it feels like. This really felt like a Goosebumps sequel, especially since Jack Black was in it. It's very over the top, it's very magical, and I think that if you feel like going to go watch a kid's movie, or you have kids, you have a younger brother, sister, take them to go watch it, they're gonna like it. If uh, you're older, you may wanna consider watching something else that has more meaning or is more impactful. Uh, for you as an audience member. I'm gonna give The House with a Clock in Its Walls a C plus. I love talking about movies, but one thing I love more is talking about movies with you. So leave a comment if you have a question or have an opinion that you'd like to share regarding The House with a Clock in Its Walls. You can also follow me on social media. I'm on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And as always, if you enjoyed this review, you can subscribe for more Icy and Chili Eskimo TV reviews.